Hello everyone and welcome back to my second ever video. I'm super excited for this one because we are doing a build. Also look at this, this is the first time I think I've ever spawned directly into a village. So that was kind of cool. So today we are making a farm. Basically like for cows, like little pens and whatnot. So not like a food farm, but like a animal farm. And so we got a tree. This is dark oak, and I tried for probably 10 minutes to get this tree to grow, and it just would not grow. And so I thought, oh, in the meantime, we can get our materials, which we're using fence. I used a dark oak, and then later I'm using birch, um, using slabs, spruce slabs. And then we are also using a birch gate for the hardware. And then I decided, let's try again to get this tree to grow. I spent so much time trying to get this tree to grow, but it just did not want to. And I mean, I suppose that's okay. So we had to do what we had to do and move to a place where a tree was already there. So I just flattened the land because you want flat land for the farm. Just because it's easier to make and look good. So yeah. And this is why the tree is important. I use it as like one of the columns and I place one fence to the tree, the gate, and then another fence. And then we're creating our little outline. And how I designed this, I want it to have a walkway so that the animals are on one side, but I can walk in without like being in their pen or being outside of the protected walls and so then you just build your fence or pen to the shape and size you want I made this one pretty big because it's going to be for cows but you could also do it for horses or sheep or cows basically whatever animal you want and then I needed to add more dirt to it because I want the pathway to be two by two and so I added a little bit more of a pathway and I also added some extra grass on the side away from our first pen so that I could make a smaller one. And so I'm doing this little L shape because it's a smaller pen. We don't need as much space. And this is just for chickens, so really you don't need to make it that big. And then I lined it up and I just connected it so that as a whole, the pen area looks like a big L. Well, kind of an L, not really. And so here's where our fences come in. This is so we can enter the animal's pens if we need to. And I'm using uh, birch fences to create a little shade area for the animals. I think this is what makes the pens look so much better. And then the spruce slabs on top. And then since chickens usually have a little house they go into, I made it so that the roof goes all the way across on the chicken pen. And then we populate the pen. <laughs> so I put cows in the big one and then chickens in the small one. And added some light fixtures to the side of the gates. And then on the chicken pen, I also added two in the back. And then I'm getting a chest out so that it seems more believable of a farm getting food for the animals like wheat and seeds. But if you're doing pigs, then you'd obviously use carrots instead. And then I decided we'd decorate a little bit more and I added some hay barrels. Um, I think it looks really good. I added a little bit in the cow enclosure and then I also added it to the side of the chest. And I figured we should also add a little water drinking area for the cows because it adds a little bit more decoration. I figured since the shape is a little strange, we should add a little farm in front of where the chickens are so that it gives an overall balanced look. So that the fence starts and then there's not just like an open gap, there's also the farm. And the farm does happen to include what these animals eat, which is pretty cool. And then we make our pathway, so using a shovel, I took the pathway from the village into up until the gate, and then from the gate, 
onwards, I use Podsole, just because I think the mud look is a little cooler. And yeah, this is our finished little farm area. I think it looks really, really good. And it definitely sells the farm look. It's better than just having a fence with animals in it. And yeah, here's a little tour.